Hey there, doers. My name is Jose Ignacio. Let's actually get right into it. How do you keep someone loyal? With a discount loyalty program, of course. We love our customers here at Stealthywood, and we want them to feel rewarded for shopping with us in the form of loyalty points. This way, they get a little extra something something every purchase that they can then cash in on later, while we keep that revenue stream aflowing. Odoo's sales app makes everything easy with the discounts and loyalty feature where I can set up different types of programs that encourage customers to keep shopping with us with deals too good to refuse. So enough chit chat, let's dive into our database to see how easy it is to work with discounts and loyalty programs using Odoo Sales. So we're getting started on the sales dashboard where we have a quick view of all active quotations and sales orders at Stealthywood. So from here, let's select configuration and then settings over there. Perfect, we've been here before. So we're working on loyalty programs today. So we wanna make sure that the checkbox happens to be there over here next to promotions, loyalty, and gift card. Make sure it's checked off like you see there. And then once it is, you hit save. So at Stealthywood, we reward our amazing return customers with a loyalty card that lets them accumulate points from their purchases. Those points can then be turned into discounts on future orders. I also think the loyalty program itself is a great way to encourage customers buy specific products for special points. They get their reward, and then we get to move inventory, specific inventory, in fact, off of our shelves. It's feeding two birds with one scone. And that is the real saying. So to get started, let's head into our products menu up at the top. And then once again, we're going to select discount and loyalty, perfect. So from here, we're gonna click into the line for stealthy points, I just talked about them. So here is the program page where we configure everything. In the program type field that we have up at the top, this one is important. We have this set to loyalty cards. And look, Odoo also lets us know what this program type does inside of the text right below it. So when customers make an order, they accumulate points they can exchange for rewards on the current order or a future one. We even give you a TLDR right there. So for now, this is just for our customers in the United States. So we have the currency set to USD, as you can tell. If you'd like to, you can also change that. So over here, we also have a points unit field. We can choose a custom name for the points that our customers accumulate. So maybe if it was Jose Ignacio, it's brother points, snack points. Because we want our customers to be wealthy over here, we're gonna call them stealthy. And that's a very good joke. Anyways, let's focus on the rules and rewards tab that we have down below. And we gotta check out some of these conditional rules. So if I actually click into conditional rules, the rectangle itself right there, would you look at that? We can see the conditions that must be met in order for a customer's purchase to earn loyalty points. So under the conditions section that we have right here in the top left, we have the minimum quantity set to one and the minimum purchase amount as well is set to zero, meaning that any purchase qualifies a customer to earn points with our loyalty program, regardless of how much they spend. For any loyalty program, however, the customer must have an account with us in order to collect loyalty points. This makes it easy to track who our loyal customers are and how many points they've earned over time. Kind of important. So they can either make an account themselves on our website or one of our salespeople can add them as a contact in Odoo. Either way, they're going to need that if they want to participate in our loyalty program. So be sure to keep that in mind. It should also be noted that if a customer is logged in and they happen to make a qualifying purchase, or if a salesperson confirms a sales order for a qualifying purchase in Odoo, then Odoo automatically adds them to the loyalty program and tracks their points. That is far too convenient, am I right? Now, as mentioned earlier, there's a great opportunity here to push some product and incentivize customers to purchase them with special points. So how do we do that? Well, first of all, we click X, we get out of here, we don't delete this. And now we're gonna exit this existing conditional rules box. We're gonna open up a new one by selecting add over here. Okay, perfect. So I'm gonna keep everything the same as our standard conditional rules that I just showed you earlier, except for the products one. We're gonna change that some stuff over here. Now, if I'm looking around, what I need to move is our acoustic block screens are super popular. We do not have, well, actually, we don't have many of them in stock. I'm sorry to say that. I'd like to incentivize my customers to order more. So we're going to click into the products field and we're gonna start typing in, there we go, acoustic block screens. 
we're actually going to add both variants. So once again, and go right in there. We got the white one. Now we got the other wood one. Perfect. I could also set specific categories if I would like to and product tags. But for now, let's keep the focus on our acoustic block screen. So over here inside of the point section, we can choose how many points we are granting and whether these points are awarded per order, per dollar amount spent, or per unit paid over there. To make this extra special for my loyal customers over here, I'm going to change this to 4.2, 420 stealthy points right there. And since there's nothing else I need to consider you're here, we're done. So all I have to do is select save and close and beautiful. It's added right there auto magically. But let's move over to our rewards card over here into this existing one. Okay. So here we have the option to give away a free product or a discount if we would like, and that's also kind of nice. But we're going to keep our set to discount. So you could do that right there as a toggle, by the way. Hopefully it didn't disappear. There we go. Just in case, I'm going to reopen it real quick. Perfect. So we're going to keep it at discount and set the discount field as well instead to 10%. Because I'm feeling generous. We're doubling it up. So we also have the options on whether to apply this discount to the customer's total order, the cheapest product, or specific products as well, which we can click on. And if we do that, it allows us to then select the targeted products for the discount field as well, if we would like to. But for now, let's apply this to order. Makes it easier anyways. And let's make it so that this discount reward costs my customers. We're going to make this one cost 100 points. Perfect. Makes it easy. So in the description over here, we have, as you may have guessed, the description of the reward on the order, which is fully customizable. So let's add a special message to our customers. Thanks for being a brother to us. Nope, a little bit too crazy there. A stealthy wooder. Do you get it? I hope you did. Anyways, we also have the option to add a max discount, which caps the order amount so that it doesn't bankrupt us. And that's how much the max that they can take off an order. And in our case, I don't want anything too crazy. So I'm going to still leave this as 10,000. Everything looks good here. So let's go ahead and save. Mm, beautiful. We're all done right there. But you'll notice up here, we have a smart button. It's the loyalty cards, which shows us that we already have a stealthy wooder using our loyalty program. And if we click that loyalty cards button over there, we'll see a separate page that shows customers with the stealthy wood points cards over here, as well as how many points they have on it. It looks like in our case, Deco Addict has an obscene amount of points. Wow. I did not expect that. But I think it's time for us to see this in action. So let's not be an enabler, but I heard that my customer Deco Addict is itching for some new acoustic block screen. To get a new order going, I think it's time for us to go show this. So to get a new order going, we're going to select orders in the top left and then quotations. And we're going to select new right there. So inside of our customer field, we're going to select Deco Addict and we're going to start typing whilst things fill out. So great. Now we're going to head down over to our product lines and select add a product. I happen to know that they want those acoustic block screens. And then we got this nice kind of cool prompt over here. So we're going to select our wood ever so amazing block screens and the quantity is three for these and then confirm that out. Perfect. We're all done. Now, once that we have these three puppies to our order, we want to add Deco Addict's hard-earned loyalty discount. And to do that, well, all we have to do is select reward down here in the bottom right. And would you look at that? Odoo automatically loads the percentage discount under a new product line. That was so easy. Now we just have to select send by email up in the top left. And once that we get our nice little prompt, we just hit send. And boom, Deco Addict's quotation is ready with their stealthy points in tow. Now, just one last thing, actually, if we were curious as to how many points our customer has, all we actually have to do is hover their name, select the internal link over here, and then the loyalty card smart button up at the top. And would you look at that? Here we go. Look at that. We see all of their special page with all of their points. And it looks like Deco Addict is still incredibly wealthy and stealthy points. And... There you have it, Odoers. Now you know how to create and use loyalty programs inside of Odoo so that you can keep your customers happy and coming back for more. I'm going to go look up furniture interventions to help Deco Addict out.
But I'm going to catch you in the next video. Go grab a snack. Today is Tim's Potato Chips. Sponsor me.